What's going on guys? This is Chandler Smith and I know right now the coronavirus is a major bummer. However, because of the coronavirus, there are some crazy sales on all kinds of stuff. And so in this video, I'm gonna start with some of the smaller sales that are just gonna save you money on stuff and then build up to the bigger sales that are not only gonna save you money, but potentially make you a ton of money in the future. So with that being said, let's jump into it. All right, guys, well, I'm way excited to get into this video. However, before I do, make sure that you push that like button and subscribe to the channel because I'm gonna do everything in my power to put you in a better financial situation and I'm hoping that this video helps a ton. However, I'm gonna be doing a lot more videos to help you to create a huge passive income and put yourself in a much better financial situation. So please make sure you push that like button and let's jump into all of the sales that you have got to jump on right now. Keep in mind, a sell is only worth something if you actually need what is on sale or you're going to use it or sell it down the road. So make sure that you don't fall victim to saying, oh, it's 50% off and end up spending that money on the other 50% for something that you don't need. So please use these sales to your advantage. If it's something that you need or are planning on needing in the near future, these should help you. However, if you don't need them, don't buy them, especially if you're stretched financially. However, I think every Everyone, regardless of your financial situation, will benefit from this video because there are some awesome sales on some things I'm sure you all need. However, there are also some other incredible sales that are going to help you make money. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to negotiate on certain things that aren't even for sale right now, but will be if you handle the situation properly. Now, the first sell I'm gonna start with is on a sell that most of you should overlook. So I'm gonna tell you right now, this shouldn't be where your money is going. However, I wanted to mention it because if you are in need of clothing, of shoes, of other things for yourself, right now is an incredible time to buy them. So if you're financially in a great place and you've got an extra thousand dollars to treat yourself, here's where you should go. There's actually a New York Post article that lists all of the different stores that are giving absolutely incredible deals. And at this point, I think most clothing stores or apparel stores are really hurting. And so they've gotten to the point where they're giving crazy deals. So I'm gonna list just a couple of these, but if you click the link down below, you can get this article. But you're talking stores like Ray-Ban, J. Crew, Gola, Free People, Susan Alexandra, Theragun, Calvin Klein, Kate Spade, Nike, North Face, Nordstrom, Kohl's. I mean, any clothing store right now is doing extraordinary deals. So if you're wanting new shoes, new clothes, new, you know, personal take care of yourself stuff, then make sure you check out that article. So I'm telling you right now, if you don't have the money, don't spend it on this, but I wanted to include these because there are tons of awesome deals. I mean, some of these places are doing 50, 75% off because they are just hurting for business. So if you're gonna spend money on clothes, now's a great time if you've got the money to do it. The next opportunity could be awesome for you personally or for your business if the timing is right. Again, don't spend on a sale if you don't need it, but right now vehicles are at an extraordinary low when it comes to prices because all of these car manufacturers, all of these dealerships are hurting for business right now. So if you're gonna buy new, they've got options to do 0% interest on a car for 84 months. Now that's absolutely insane for your payment and for everything else. Just make sure you're not overpaying for the car and you still negotiate. Because a lot of people go in and they're like, oh, I'll take it, but you've still got a lot of room to negotiate on those because for them, it's kind of a sunk cost giving up that interest. So remember, you can negotiate. Also, if you go in willing to make a cash purchase because you're sitting on a lot of money right now and you're planning on getting a car anyways, you should negotiate like crazy. You should get multiple dealerships involved and really go hard. Because if your business or your family needs a new car, I don't think you're ever gonna find a better opportunity to negotiate and get these dealerships to act out of fear to be able to work a deal with you. So that's the next big sale I wanna hit on, but also a sale that only makes sense if you really need it, don't go buy a car because it's on sale. Buy it because you need it for your business or for your family. All right, now is when we get into the deals I'm a little more excited about. 
However, they're going to require a little bit more work for you. The first one is purely for fun. So if you're in a good financial situation, this could be awesome. It could also be a great opportunity to build relationships with people within your business, and that is traveling. Now, I know a lot of you are saying, Chandler, you're an idiot. The coronavirus is going on. Come on, we gotta get rid of the curve. Yeah, I totally get it. I wouldn't suggest flying, even though it's super cheap. Same with cruise lines. I'm not suggesting those things. Now, if you need to, you need to, and you can get a great deal on those. However, what I'm suggesting is vacation rentals. Just recently, I have reached out to a bunch of vacation rentals because I've got a lot of people in my business that are looking to move out somewhere for the summer. And what's so cool about vacation rentals right now is usually a place that would be $500 a night is willing to drop down to like $2,000 for an entire month. So if you're someone that can work remotely and you've always wanted to live in some awesome mansion or cool place or hook up someone that works within your business or whatever it is, if you call them and negotiate, you can get an extraordinary deal on vacation rentals or on Airbnb because all of them are desperate to at least pay some portion of their mortgage. Now, I know there are lots of ways you could take this and manipulate it and find a way to make money or find a way to benefit your business. I'm not gonna go into those, but I want you to know if you are willing to do even a little bit of negotiation with vacation rentals, you can get a huge discount. The way I suggest doing this is sending out a message, and I know this because I've personally done it, but send out a message to a place that you'd like to drive to and stay with your family that's a higher end place or that you'd like to treat someone within your business business and their family that's working remotely and you know that maybe they're living in a situation in a crappy small apartment and they're cramped and you could hook them up and win their trust forever, then this is how you do it. So what I have done for my employees is I've reached out to a place where they're needing to live for the next couple months. I've sent an email to the person that says, hey, we are looking to put someone here potentially for three to four months. Maybe it's one month, we don't know. We just want to do one month at a time. However, if you're willing to take us and you get down to the price range that we need, they are awesome people, they work for me, I can promise they're gonna keep great care of the place. However, their price range is substantially lower and I personally have done vacation rental. I wanna help the local vacation rentals instead of going and renting them an apartment. So here is our budget per month. Do you think that's something that you can do? So you're gonna do a super low ball offer. If they're offering $500 for a day, I'm gonna throw out an offer for like 1500 for the month and see where they come out at. This is a great opportunity for you to go and experience something different, live somewhere different, or if you're even just wanting to go for a week or something like that, you can drive to the location, get an awesome place with a sick pool, a ton of room, a great place to work from home, and you can get it for an absolute steal. Now, maybe this doesn't make sense for you and your business. However, if you negotiate, you can get extraordinary deals on vacation rentals right now. Okay, now for the fun ones that I think can really help you to make money. The first one is eBay or Craigslist. Right now, people are struggling for money. Now, I'm not telling you to take advantage of you. I'm telling you if you have money and you have some kind of furniture you need for a vacation rental or you have some kind of vehicle or you have some kind of need for your home, whatever it is, when it comes to Craigslist and eBay, you can find insane deals right now. It's gonna be the same for anything that's a collectible, anything that's tradable, any of these things. If you've got money set aside and you know a niche like that, it is an extraordinary time to reach out to these people and start negotiating. And all you've gotta say is, look, this is my budget for this. I totally understand that you're trying to sell it here. However, this is where I would pay for it and be happy with it. And if you can do that, I would love to have it. There is nothing wrong with going through and sending out tons of messages and seeing the response that you get. And make sure you include, look, if this doesn't seem fair to you, just keep me in mind. If a couple weeks go by and you don't find anyone else, I'm your guy. Reach out, I'll buy it in a heartbeat from you. This should give you an awesome opportunity to pick up killer deals on something that heck, even four or five, six months, maybe a year, maybe two years from now, could be worth way more. It's also a great opportunity to pick up things that you need 
for your business, whether it's your rental property, whether it's your business, whether it's whatever it is, this is a great time to reach out and start negotiating because if people have things listed, I can promise you usually they're in a situation where they're in need of money and if you can be a guaranteed deal, look, I promise I'll buy it from you, I'm good to go at this price, they're gonna jump all over that. So take advantage of eBay and Craigslist and if you're someone that trades something or collects something and you know a niche, take advantage of this timing. It's a great time to negotiate. And so if you've always wanted to start that card collection or you've always wanted to start collecting whatever it is, jump on it. It's a great opportunity to get something at a huge discount that you could potentially sell later. The next one I wanna hit on, and this one is huge, and that is labor. There are so many people that right now, whether they're still working their job or they're laid off and they're in a financial bind, even if they've gotten their stimulus check, they would love to have more money. And I know there are lots of hungry people out there that I've given the advice, look, if you've gotten laid off, find another way to create income. And so what I've done is if I've got certain projects I've been waiting to do, this is the time to get labor done. So whether it's getting flooring done, whether it's putting in sod, whether it's just doing yard work, whatever it is for your rental properties, for your business, this is the time to put out ads on Facebook or reach out to businesses and say, hey, I really need this done, but with everything going on, I'm on a really tight budget. What kind of deals are you guys doing? What do you cost right now? Get people competing. Everyone right now is stressed. They don't know what the future is going to bring. They don't know how their business is going to do. And a lot of them, their business has drastically been affected. If your property has gotten run down or had issues, this is a great time to clean up. It's a great time to fix that stairway that you've been a little sketch about or whatever it is because now you can get an incredible deal on it. Now, I recognize you might be tight on funds, but especially if you've got a business loan or other opportunities and the deal is 25 or 50% off on getting this work done that you know you're going to need done in the next year, now is the time to jump on getting quick and cheap labor done because everyone's stressed and everyone's willing to work for cheaper than usual. Now, the next thing I wanna get into is huge, and that is that every business right now is worried and struggling and stressed. Same with every individual. So it's an incredible time to renegotiate, especially when you've got something consistent, a consistent bill every month, because that's what gives people the feel goods. So if you can go to them and you're currently on a month to month scenario or your agreement's gonna be up soon, you can tell them, look, I know we're month to month or I know my agreement's coming up. I want to continue to give you my business. However, right now things are crazy, money's tight, what can you do for me? Are you willing to do this? Would you be willing to drop your price to this? Now, they might say no, and that's okay, but it's an awesome opportunity to get competition involved and to ask. It never hurts to ask, especially when you explain, look, this is how my business has been affected. I'm hurting, I'm nervous, but I don't want my business to you to dry up. And so are you willing to work with me? What kind of deal can we work out where we both can win? And with this situation, there are hundreds, probably even thousands of things like this that I promise you, if you're willing to just make the call, build the relationship, tell them your situation and begin to negotiate or get competition involved, it's an awesome opportunity to capitalize on saving your business money. So if there's something you've wanted to add to your business or build your business or bring in some additional service that's going to help your business, now is an awesome time to reach out and say, look, I've been thinking about this for the last year. I was really seriously thinking about jumping on it until our business got smacked with this coronavirus thing. However, I figured I might as well reach out and see if you guys have any deals going because I know we need it. I just need some help if I'm going to be able to afford it. Find a way to make this thing a positive, all right? Because by you making it a positive, by you spending money on something when someone's willing to give you a discount, that's gonna help your business. You're not gonna talk someone into giving you a deal that's gonna hurt them. If anything, you're only gonna be able to help them and help yourself. Finally, I wanna jump into the last point, and I think this is the biggest point I will make for anyone that watches my videos, and that is real estate. I know everyone's wondering what's going to happen next when it comes to real estate, and the reality is I don't know what's going to happen, but I do know even today 
there are extraordinary deals. Now, I know a lot of you are saying, well, Chandler, what if I buy something at 15% off, but then the market creates a 30% off market here a year from now? Well, here is my answer to you. No one completely knows how bad this is going to get. However, if you can look at your market where you're going to invest or where you're going to buy a home and say, all right, what is the worst case scenario? What would be the worst, most catastrophic situation? Figure out what you think that would do to the market, whether it's 30, 40%, and then structure your deals as if it is a worst case scenario so that that's the kind of deal you're looking for and I promise you, you can find them right now. It might be a lot more difficult, but I promise you will find absolutely extraordinary deals because people are acting out of fear. And if you put that deal together, don't feel bad because obviously it was a win for them if they were willing to do it. So jump all over that. Find a way to win in this market. On top of that, if you do buy a 15% off deal and the market drops 30%, it's okay. It's a buy and hold situation. Five to 10 years from now, you won't remember the difference because you're going to end up winning on it. Just make sure it has strong cash flow. So even if you do need to drop down to break even or even losing a little money, you can do that and you're going to be set. One last thing, I'd be a total idiot if I didn't include this in. I just, I was going to skip on it because I'm not much of a stocks and bonds kind of guy. However, I would be an idiot to not tell you that there are some incredible deals in the stock market right now. We all know that it's taken a huge hit. Do I know what those are? No, because I haven't put in the time to research. However, right now I've got a bunch of other stuff going on and I know I'm going to find some killer deals in real estate, but I can promise you there are great deals in the stock market as well if you know what you're doing and I'm sure you can find some great deals there as well. All right, guys, those are all of the sales I have for you. And I'm sure I missed a ton because here's the deal. Everything is on sale if you negotiate properly. And when it comes to negotiating, the biggest thing you need to do is ask. All right. Even if you're not the best negotiator, figure out what you would be okay paying for something and then just ask for that. And if they say no, that's fine. Just say, all right, that's okay. I'm going to go somewhere else. Or if they say no, get competition involved. Or if they say yes, but it's a little higher, say, hey, let me think that over and then go get competition involved. But at the end of the day, you've just got to ask. I don't have to go into all of this nitty gritty negotiation tactics because all you have to do is ask. Whether it's email, whether it's direct message, whether it's in person, whether it's phone call, just ask for a discount and don't buy, don't be sold unless it meets the criteria for what you need. Now, for those of you who are wanting to get into investing in real estate and you don't know what a good deal is, I am more than happy to help you. I've done tons of videos on creating a passive income and building a real estate empire. And so if you've got questions about that, check out the other videos. And I do a mentorship program where if you want to do a call for me, hop onto my website at www.chandlerdavidsmith.com. And I would love to do a phone call and help you through this time, help you analyze a deal, help you with whatever you need help with so that you can put yourself in a better financial situation, even though all of this crap is going on. So if you guys enjoyed the video, please push the like button, subscribe to the channel, and we'll look forward to seeing you in the future videos. Thanks guys. Have a great day.